А вы Вы... Pardon? Yeah. Ahoy, everyone, and welcome aboard. I'll be your Captain Alien tonight, along with... Are you so man? Still seek literature here at your service. And, yeah, it's because uh, Drakir is being most sickly. No, no, uh, just no Valheim. Also, I just noticed that, yeah, these 
OBS stats thing popped up again, so let me just move that away. Yeah, Here we I, go. I was ready for Valheim just in case, but then the damn thing came back. <laughs> so yeah, good thing more Dave then. So this will be the first time I think we've played the same game twice or streamed the same game twice in a, a day. I think I've done it before actually. But the whole thing was more due to we were so close to finishing the game, another game before. You know what? Let's do a second stream and finish it off. I wonder what game it was though. Maybe. Let's see. Ooh, we've got a notification of our pets. Or our Neo pets, you could call it. Uh, what's with the skull? Uh, uh, manage zero years old, so hungry and needs affection. Okay. Okay, n nice little tune, I'll say that. Oh yeah, last time uh, <laughs> we escaped from a giant fucking Gadon, who was likely the uh, guy who made the Gadons in the first place. And well, does that mean that they're sick or something? It is the perp okay. No, that I think that was a warning that they uh, <laughs> that they were going to die or something. Uh, hello. Okay. Oh. Okay, that raised affection. Uh, let's do one more thing. Yep, another again. Right, left, middle, right. Hmm. Okay. Uh, I guess that'll do for the moment. Uh, leave the light on. No need to clean. There's no need to. I don't think there's a need to discipline it at the moment. Okay, uh, let's see. Cherry tomatoes, let's plant those. Okay, I think that's just going to pop up every now and then. That it just needs food or something. Yeah, I don't... I'm not sure if I like the yellow part. It's just a mean game, fine. But I do feel like it, it, it can become annoyance. Maybe, we'll, we'll see how it goes. For now, though, we have... Uh, do we have a second dive today? Yes, we do. Uh, let's see. Revenge time. Find the vortex. Okay, that's only at night, and it's not night yet. Okay, we've got all the ingredients for that. What, not yes, a vortex? Spawning night. Oh. 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 Yeah, so we're... Klaus is one of the shark bosses. Yep. Uh, let's see. Hmm. All right, we need to talk to Cobra first. See, people. Doctor Bacon was right. You have to promote this to attract customers. Uh, yep. We start that already. Uh. Uh. Yeah. Okay. This is all repeat stuff. Hmm. Okay. I guess we're going to talk to him tomorrow then. That means for now, we just need to go around and swim and see what we find. Um, yeah, more sharks. <laughs> yeah. Anything in the shop? Oh, net sensor trap. Hmm. Can we use that to capture sharks, maybe? I hope so. Will we can capture two sharks at once. Awesome. Uh, I, doubt, I doubt we can get two sharks close enough for that. Okay, question is now, do we go from the top to the bottom, or from the bottom to the top? I'm thinking we go from mm. the bottom. That way yeah, we can see if there's any new sharks in the deep. And we can get some, uh, we, we can put this, we can bring the seahorses over to the arcade and get uh, a snack from Mimas. Yeah. Okay, I, I just like this little tune here. 
Yeah, love and tune it. <laughs> it's it's a kind of a comic book scene in a way. What's it gonna do? Yeah. Uh, let's see. How's the farm? Let's see. Oh. Okay. Can cultivate special kelp with a very chewy texture. Yep. Okay. Yeah, this is where one of the places where we get to use our money here. Um. Let's take off. Bring the seahorses here, and we can do a race with them. Okay, 40, 35. I'm mostly glancing at the uh, stats. Uh, let's see. Okay, let's try this one. It, since it seems we need... Oh, okay, we don't need to do that to open up the next... We need to do this one to open up this one. So each combined one opens the next combined and such. Uh, let's see. Do we have... Oh, okay, you... Okay, we are. We don't stand a chance here. Yeah, we have nothing that can be beat that. Not even close. Okay. So that means we need to find some very special seahorses somewhere. Oh, let's see. 43 is the highest. Uh, let's see. Obstacle. Let's go with this one here. Okay. This time I need to remember it's it's, it's not a combined race, so it's just the uh... yep. up too early. Oh well. Yep. Okay, we can just power through. <laughs> That's also a way to win. There we go, more than enough. Okay. I'm pretty sure we can afford all of the other seaweed farm bits. Let's do one here. Let's see. 50, 50, okay. Uh, let's see. You have 52. Actually, let's see one with high speed, 52 max. Hmm. Okay, it does seem to sort them by their uh, by their stats. So let's put this one in the in last, and then we put these two here. Now, if I can manage to not mess up the uh, pass along, this should be more than set. Behind at the moment. Yeah, it does not look like a sea. It looks like a monkey or an ape. Yeah, I don't know if these chimpanzees do that. Okay, I don't think we're going oh, to win this one. Oh, I think orangutans uh, does that. Oh, come on, developers. That's mean. So that doesn't help as well. Go over. Okay, yeah, we're we're going to end dead last with this. Okay, I was probably overconfident. Yeah, I, probably, yeah. I should have checked out the other competitors as well. Oh, oh. Uh, what are they doing? Okay, we're not going to end up last at least. Uh, third place is still pretty good. And Dave agrees, it seems. <laughs> okay. It's... Okay, no reward for it, but still. Okay. Yep, let's head out. <clears throat> Alright then. Uh... I'm guessing the workshop is still closed, but let's take a peek. 
Yeah. Are you okay? The water temperature keeps changing so rapidly. I'm not feeling well. It's not just me. Many of us, many of us got sick. We must find what caused this and quickly resolve the issue. Yeah, e even if that is Dashe downstairs who is causing the quakes, that doesn't explain the temperature changes. Is it there been too much divine fruit about? Hmm, not sure. But they, but they are maybe, able to melt the ice. Maybe his trashing around was breaking the ice or something? Perhaps. Mima for the dumplings. And it's a harpoon. Yeah, let's go with that. I, I don't know why she needs to take a moment to gloat during that. <laughs> or would it be gloating? Either way, we got food. I almost feel like this is based on someone the developers know. Yeah, like someone's grandmother or something. Let's see. Awesome. Seed grape seeds. Let's let's get a bunch of all of these. We have a good amount of all. I think we have a decent amount of everything except for maybe seed grapes. Now we go shark hunting. Again, I'm so happy I have a recliner. <laughs> I can basically turn it into a bed. I even turn my screen a bit at moon by my closer so I can properly look. Okay. Oh, we need some of you. I even got a blanket. There. There. Okay, get in the box. Okay, if we get some row from that, we'll have a breeding pair of them. <clears throat> okay. Now, are yeah, we going to find like sharks? sharks. Be... Hmm. Yeah. How big of a priority should it be? Like, priority, yes, but how big of a priority should it be? Now we don't really have much we can uh, else we can really do too much towards except maybe f hunt some of these and hunt some other things for the eco watcher thing but that'll be more of a chance if we run into those in the first place we have absolutely yeah. no need for that let's use this we want to get as much help as possible we can upgrade and have plenty to serve but oh, we do need oh, some artificial sweat to serve in the meantime I just realized the mistake. I forgot to swap back the uh, necklace, so we do need the UV lights. Oh. Okay. Oh, oh well. we're here. No. We're doomed. Uh, not that badly, but still. Then we need oh, to hunt. There's the, there's the star gazer. We need to drop a rock on you to get rid of you. Okay, that also deals with them. Or counts towards dealing with them. Okay, uh, Bit of a I carry, but them. well... Like... If that was a tyranid, I would get it for that would literally be a biological weapon. But a yellowfish exploding for... Yeah, I don't get that. I don't yeah. get why animals in nature would explode themselves. I don't get that. Uh, the reasoning behind that would probably be that by detonating, the uh, others of the species can evolve or they just start... or predators just start avoiding them. Which reminds me, I actually learned about 
a creature in a Warhammer 40k uh, on one of those oh. death worlds, Catacan or something, they're called a a barking toad or something. <laughs> that, that's yeah, that that sounds dumb on its own. But the thing is, if those things uh, get agitated, uh, they basically blow themselves up and leave behind a gas, a cloud of toxic gas that can even kill space marines Did in their the armor. Did you watch the YouTuber who does the bestiary profiles, or did you watch Text to Speech? Uh, I actually watched a channel that has that has been using the, an AI voice of uh, David Attenborough, the uh, You've wildlife. Seen <laughs> yep. Too. I think I told you about him. Now, come on, you. Oh. And I was saying, I actually thought there was David Attenborough at first. But the more yeah. I watched the more I started to notice if something was off. I thought it was just impersonation, I realized, oh yeah, AI. Yeah, David but, A. Eitenborough, I believe they're called more like. Yeah, but often knowing that kind of scares me now, in a way. Yeah. Hmm. Oh, hello. Oh, okay. Ow. No, wrong one. Oh, hey. You're coming with me. <laughs> oh, good god, sharks. Destroyer of submarine radars and sonar. Is it radar or the scanner or whatever it, that usually covered in rubber? Uh, not sure. Yeah, but it's one of those things they love to go and bite on. They also wreck havoc on, leaving cookie holes on. I think in general, a lot of a submarine is covered in a sort of rubber to absorb uh, sonar. Yeah. But again, imagine you have to return to base just because you had a few sharpish cookie cut sharks biting holes in it. Yeah, that would be embarrassing. It, and like, it happens a lot, apparently. Millions of dollars in military equipment defeated by a five year old shark. Basically, yeah. Dude, there has been one that was attacked by an unknown squid. And recently, no one's squid was put. Some of its barbs were stuck that, that, in the rubber. Okay, yeah, that confirms that. The net is too small for a big shark like this. What kind of net you used? The steel one. The, the net gun, I mean? No, or... the mine. Oh. Okay, okay, the mine should not work on these, yeah. Uh, Maybe on the smaller sharks. Yeah, it was worth a try, better to have it confirmed than to never try and wonder why the hell it's... If, whether it would or not. I think I saw another cookie cutter here. 11 kilos? Wait, only 11 kilos? From that? Uh... It looks... Uh, maybe, yeah. Ow. Go. No, we need to get no, rid of you. It, it's gears makes it look like it has a collar. <laughs> like a dog shark. <laughs> we can dump you out. We can probably dump a bunch of the jellyfish as well since they're only one meat each. You are coming along, though. Uh, let's see. This is the underground. This goes to the underwater lake. Is there anything else of interest here? Oh, I can definitely grab this, though. Hmm. Maybe we can find another goblin shark. Hmm. 
That would actually be pretty perfect timing if there's another goblin shark here for us to fight. Since that was a good uh, dish we could make from it. Yeah. It would be weird if you can only make those dishes just once. Yeah, I'm presuming some bosses can be fought again. There. Yoink. Okay. I'm guessing there's not going to be, since, well, we would have seen it. Well, for, for one, we probably would have seen it for a second. There wouldn't be all of these smaller fish around if there was a predator nearby. Yeah. There. Can't we really? Yeah, we really can't go up through that. Okay, let's head out and go look for some sharks we can actually find then. Actually, I've rarely used this, but let's, let's use it here since we're heading towards shallower water. So we'll have a much better chance of finding oxygen tanks and such. Overall, I've been really conservative with the use of oxygen, or rather the expenditure of it. But I think we have enough knowledge of the area that we can use it up a bit more. Plus, I've typically been opening those gas canisters and such when only at around 50%. Like, it's only been a rarity that we've been lower than that. Yeah, it's usually it. due to unexpected combat. Hmm. Mosinaga. What? Mosinagant. It's, it's basically. It's a sniper rifle. Oh. Okay. Is this going to go lower or a little more to the left? I'm guessing that box over there is going to have a blue hello. We'll grab that for the blueprints. And a grenade yeah. launcher. Yep. This is going to. Okay, I thought it was going. To... Yep. Ah, mother. F oh. What did you say? Look out! Okay, I was expecting it, it to give a <laughs> a pickaxe because we're near a rock or near a mineable rock. That was. Oop, another big mouth. I wonder, if we put one of those these down and it tries to suck up, would it... Okay, it does not suck in the mine. <laughs> Question answered. Pity. Okay. Pickaxe. Yep, pickaxe. Uh, might as well grab it. I have no plan to. Uh, <laughs> I have no plan to go into melee with sharks. Wait. Let's just let's just dump out the comb jelly. We we have plenty of meat of that in storage, I believe, since we've been breeding them. Seven kilos yeah. for one meat is not worth it. Yeah, we're only killing them in self-defense at the moment. Okay. That's the seaweeds harp uh, gatherer's place. Uh, grabbing that would probably get me shocked. <laughs> Ow. Frilled shark. Um, I think we need to get rid of more of these, or of those, for one of the eco challenges. Out. And it's a shark after all, so 
Yeah, I meant the jellies. Oh. But yeah, we can get the shark for the meat. But first, I'm going to look for oxygen because, yeah. Yeah, that was a bit costly. Oxygen tank? No. Yep. Okay. I'll take it along. Yep. Mm, yeah, we are not in trouble. <laughs> okay, if that hadn't <laughs> been an oxygen tank, uh, yeah, that might have been a problem. Okay. Are there two of these frilled sharks here? Or is that no, there's two of them? Uh, oh, there's two. Do we need to get rid of any more of these? No, otherwise it would have t given a tick there. Oh, for a okay. second. Is can shark? He freely, yeah. freely, freely. He freely, freely, freely. We're going to kick its ass. No frills about that. We're going to have more than plenty of shark meat for all of this. And if we can kill Klaus, we will definitely have plenty of frilled shark teeth. Yeah, I was feeling like Klaus might actually be one of those things we want to have prepared for the damn festival. Yep. That's. Ah, so this probably way. him the day before? Probably is a good idea. Yeah, the, the boss uh, the boss dishes so far have been a one artisan flame anyways, and so we should have more of them plenty for that as well. Okay. I'll take that. Yeah. And you can take this. Open wide. Uh, you... Oh, wait, did you miss? No, it would... Oh, wait, right. no. no, it would attack you otherwise. Yep. But it almost okay. looked like you missed. <laughs> now then, we should be about at the... Now I'll leave that. Or are we at the... the bon yes, we are at the top half of the depths, I believe. So just checking, actually I should keep, yeah, this is going to lead out so we can leave the flashlight behind and swap it in for another oxygen tank in case we get uh, a bit too com a bit too close to one of the other sharks that we're going to hunt. Okay, I need to get rid of Thank two of more of those. Fang took the, Fang took that sounds rather weird when you think about it. Hmm. I'm guessing whoever encountered those first had a, uh, <laughs> a rather up close and personal encounter with those teeth. Possibly. Hmm. Uh, let's see. Sorted by weight. Let's dump out anything that isn't a shark at the moment. Uh, those are small stuff. Okay. Um, yeah, I'll take it. It'll help us be able to move around after we get enough me enough weight, uh, enough material to be slowed down again. Oh, seaweed. Oh. We need a row of that, I think, so I'll just catch one of it. Oh, oh curry block. Okay, that's, that's now spawning here as well. 
And I'm going to... Yeah, I'm going to annoy these two. But mostly to see if we can get a fin off of them. For an upgrade to our rifle. Okay. No fin. No fin. Okay. Barracuda. There's the other one. Yeah, uh, yeah. We are already for only 30 minutes in, so a bit early for fin. Let's see how long it takes for healing to get the reference. Uh, I'm not acknowledging the reference. <laughs> yeah, for those who doesn't get it, I don't know in what language, but apparently feeling in some movies means the end. No, uh, French, I believe. Uh, it might be French, yeah. Okay. The mean thing is that I don't, I'm not interested in their meat at all with this. I just want their fin. Oh yeah. It means something else in, in Swedish, though. Oh. Uh, fin. Spell the same. Fin. F -A -I -I -F -I -N. Means pretty. Okay. Wait, wait, oh, these little things? Is huh. a fiena. These little things weigh a kilo each. Okay. Uh, I'm just going small. to dump you out. Yeah, but still, like, a kilo fives. for one of those. Now, they, they, gave fives, a different, they gave it different... They gave different amounts. Some were three, some were four, and some were five. Or one was five, to be more accurate. But it huh. depends how big the world you caught. Nope. Doesn't rank 5 mean it's good? good. Big boy? Well... Yeah. Trapped between a barracuda and a tiger shark. Well, not a tiger shark, but still a shark. Okay. Just to get you out of the game. Yeah. And when it's wiggling like that, or when it's flapping its tail like that, or however you would call that, that's when it's going to charge. These sharks are ex enormous! Hmm. Yep. I did not mean to use that, but okay. Uh, let's see. Uh, game, why won't you move down from that? Uh... There. Okay, that was weird for a second. Let's guard that. Okay, now we can pick something up still. Okay. Hmm. Let's see if there's anything useful in this. Okay, very useful. I say we take on one more shark if we can find one. And then we call it there. All right. I think that was the sound of something spawning. Nope. Oh, electric ray. Nope. Not a no. Ow. Nope. Okay, if you're being insistent, so. Wait, are you a Mako Shark? I just might be Mako Sharks. I don't think that's a blue high. Uh, blue Shark, I mean. I said it in Swedish okay. accidentally. Oh. Okay. Yes, yes. Yeah, yeah. Oh, come on! Okay, uh, the game should have paused there f yeah, for a second after going out there. Uh... Just above the... Just at the freaking... Uh, okay, so it was a tiger shark. 
just at the freaking surface. Okay, I'll take some of the tiger shark meat then. But not mega mouth? I thought that was better. Yeah, it's hmm. Actually, let's rank six. Okay, rank seven. Okay, mega mouth then. But that that was a bit that was unfair, I'd say. Uh, okay, I I did press the wrong button there, but I would have <laughs> it would have been nice if the game had given a moment's pause for letting me select a leave or not. Okay, but that but that's probably me just being salty. Okay, at least we had these two still. Okay. Yep. Oh, this patch. Yeah. Oh, bloody hell. Yeah, we need to be careful for... We cannot afford to do that repeatedly. Okay, that... Okay, we still had... A, we still got a lot of shark meat from all of that. And, yeah, we, we still have... A, a, we still have a lot of days until the event. Yeah, we, we can do another... We can do a night dive if there's any night sharks. Yeah, the Klaus should be around now. So, yeah. Let's go uh, say hello of uh, hello and of Wiedersehen to uh, a German shark. Okay, some bird is, some make, is making odd noises outside. Okay. We can use that. We can plant agar now, but I still think I still think it's a good idea to just pick it up whenever we find it. And it just means more agar. A noosh. That okay. one looks new. Yeah, you can be our uh, our first meal. Our first course. You can eat a whole shark. Send you off. Okay. Black tip reef shark. Okay. The almost fucking sink. Bunch of trigger fish down there. <clears throat> Trying to keep an ear out for any sounds of the vortex. <clears throat> Barracuda. No, not Barracuda, it's a, it's a Mori eel. How did I get that wrong? Yeah, okay, just squish that giant thing into the box. Oh, there's the vortex. Uh... Okay, I doubt that's going to work. <laughs> Oops, a vortex. Does this mean that uh, that, yeah, that there is the great shark? Er, that there is the great white shark's hideout inside? Yeah, the, the translation errors can be a bit noticeable in some of these things. I'll just go check inside and call the old lady. Yeah, the, I'd say that with the way that Clara is dressed in that suit, it does make me think they are referencing Clara. Uh, hello there. Klaus in the house. Ah, I knew it was here. I must quickly call the old lady. Where's the walkie-talkie? Oh my god, I didn't ask her phone number. How oh, ferocious looking. I should find a way out before it opens. Guten Tag. Yeah. 
Okay, here we go. Two streams, two bosses. It woke up? Uh, we need to buy time until that old lady returns. How would she even know where to find? Unless she bugged us or something. Okay. I don't think she even got that close to us. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we get stuck on the meat. Oh, it deals a lot of damage. Okay. Luckily, we can restart on boss fights like this. Okay, but yeah, we need to. This is a case of objective survive. Yeah, I, I need to sprint to stay ahead of it here. If a scooter would have been useful. Yep. Uh, oh, it's going for some special attack. Uh, give me that quickly. Oh. Okay. Shark used whirlwind. I was just say Klaus used whirlpool. Yep. Okay, I think I pissed it off. I'll okay, yeah. Uh Okay, yeah, he is a tough motherfucker. Holy macaroni. Okay, let's give this another try. Can we find an upgrade in this, maybe? Quickly. Barely dodge that. Okay. 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 We need to be careful not to get between it and the ground, or it will get us. Or it will get Dave. Uh, uh, what are you up to? Now that is what you're up to. Ammo. Okay. Up, up. Try to stay above it. Up. Are those sharks on that thing on that board there? Okay. Yeah, I'd say this is a good reason why we should work on upgrading our guns some more. Yeah. Hey, oh. oh, damn it. Yeah. And, hmm. Okay, let's let's give it a let's give it one more shot. And this time I'm just going to grab the ammo immediately. We'll probably get more as the fight goes. I just need to pick my shots a lot more carefully. Yep. They say that more and not get stuck. To run away. And more that the, it doesn't have enough range to hit him while staying safe. Oh. Yeah, the sniper rifle might have been more useful here. Oop. I don't think we can. I don't think I can take on Bruce at the moment. Hmm. 
One last try. I doubt we can beat him with this. <laughs> Maybe we can give him a heart attack from laughing too much. I should probably try to attack him only after he does a charge like that because he's left wide open for a bit. Yeah, just jousting him might be the best option. Yeah, he's going for the special attack, which gives me an opportunity to grab ammo. Okay, yeah. Easy enough. We just need to stay away from him. As much as he'd rather we stay close. And, uh, okay, just keep keeping distance. Oh, he's going for the attack. Special. If we can just keep jousting him. Just barely missed. Okay. Yeah, but the problem is that that attack leaves him at a distance that. It... Mm. Okay, I yeah, I think I have I think I have a strategy now of how to beat him. It's just getting oh. out of that special attack. That's when we are the most vulnerable because then his charge puts him close to us. We want his charge to make to go past. This one's going to fail as well. We got too close too quickly. Nope. Uh, if I just stay down here, can he not hit? He's going to hit. Okay. Yeah, I I can see why. Uh, I can see why Clara has been chasing him for thirty six years. Okay. Timing on that. Yeah, if he's going for that, it's bad for us because it's not going to make him going to keep him at distance. We need him to charge, not to bite. Okay. Now, what if I stay somewhat close for this? He alternates each time, so it's predictable where the next one will be. There. Okay, enough distance for a charge. It's barely dodging him. Red one did. Guns, don't there a trigon? Yeah, oh, he's going for the special, damn it. Okay, that'll give us time to go grab the oxygen, maybe? Nope. Is that high enough? That's high enough, okay. It was a triple axle last time, yes. If it was an upgraded one, I don't know. <laughs> okay, especially can we can check. Yeah, if I wanna, could that be a better weapon for this? Uh, that, actually, that would be a terrible weapon for this because we need to be even closer for that. Uh, oh, oh yeah, that. Yeah, I guess more damage, but the, way too close. Way shorter yeah, range. Okay. Okay, we can put one between his eyes. Out of ammo. Okay, there's ammo on the right. I 
do hope we're going to get more oxygen. Oh, come on. Hmm. Yeah, we really need to avoid being hit at all, it seems. Okay, final try. And then we'll have to call it off. Okay, one more try because this was BS with... Yeah, just eat me already. Okay, I will give them props for the, the hitboxes being very accurate to the model and such. It, it's a split second decision. If we're aiming whilst he's charging, we're going to get hit. Actually, probably be smarter to try to swim over him, since the fin there is smaller. Okay, come on. There. Okay, he's going for that. Come on. Actually, now let's try being on the other side of the room, since he's going to charge, but that's hopefully should leave enough distance still. Oh, he's up there. So he's going to charge. Okay. Make distance. Yeah, I hoped he would uh, knock himself out a little bit there. A moment. Nope. Oh, now he's going for the special again. Okay. Complete opposite sides. He's not alternating anymore. No problem. <laughs> that attack is such a wide reach on it. Special. Can we get low enough to grab the oxygen? Probably not. Nope. Uh, yeah. Yeah. I think my. I think we have to watch for the blasted shark more, Cobra. Uh. Let's bring in the moray. It probably would be actually more value to get the items from them, but oh well. But yeah, that shark is tough as balls. Oh, yeah. <laughs> now I get a little piece, piece. Like the first one here went so well, but then Just so close to the, the finish end. line, you got defeated. We could have got some so much short meat, and now with Klaus? That's more of, of just. Not, I like just more of his. He's tough. Yeah, he's it, hard. He's the Dark Souls of Dave the Diver. That's. Only Shark Souls? Oh, oh no, I. I, 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 I made myself cringe hmm. from that pun. 35 damage, 8 in the magazine, and 5 range. Now, if we go look at the sniper rifle, 47, 3 in our magazine, but 20 range. We could make that. Hmm. Only 3 in the magazine. Hopefully we yeah, can upgrade the magazine. Okay. Yes, we can equip that. Let's see. Would, this would put one... Up, okay, also Giant Trevale. Hmm. Let's see. All of them have three. 
You have three, uh, have a, yeah, a magazine of three. Hmm. It's, this would be 130, no, 131 damage, no, uh, no, 141 damage per ammo box that we collect. But we would be certain to hit him, because that's, that's the issue. We, we either stay too close and get hit, or we stay too far out of range. Okay. Oh, we're, we're low on iron ore. Okay. Yeah, and we need one new, more sniper rifle to make an upgraded version, apparently. Let's also just do this. That should help some. Okay. Uh, cards. Cookie cutter. Something else as well. Uh, up here. Then some... Okay, the glacier uh, glacier passage doesn't have that many fish, it seems. But okay, that's because the glacier uh, zone. That's where it's at. Okay. Uh, eco watcher. Yeah, remove jellyfish. We need two more fang te tooth to get that one. We can get this one. Okay, one more, anything more, and we get the next thing, which is the Eco Gemstone Bracelet. Which, again, I have no idea what that does. Uh, we can deliver these. Hmm. Okay. Uh, at least it wasn't a complete waste of time. So let's go to the restaurant and serve some sushi. Yeah, I hope next day will be better for us for... Uh... Yeah, Klaus is a tough motherfucker. Yeah, we need to click more shot bit, at least I'll be more careful. Let's see... Some... Okay, this is very expensive vegetable rice. I think it has high quality ingredients. Uh... Let's put five up. Let's see. Sea grape. Let's put 10 of that. Let's see. 21. We had 23 visitors last time. So let's aim for another 30 ish. Uh, tuna. Uh, one of these. Just use up the last rice. 11, 21, 22. Uh, yeah, ton of that. Okay. Uh, how is the staff? We can research something. Uh, let's see, 9, 12. Let's try and keep one artisan flame for if we do manage to beat Klaus eventually. Let's see, black vinegar braised parrot fish. Let's do that. been a bit since we've seen this animation, I think. Yeah. Okay. Staff. Uh, we can train you. Oh, a new skill. Yep. Let's see. Uh, details. Yeah, serve drink perfectly. Okay. So why do you get only little amounts of that, or is that just to, to balance things out? Oh well. Get these removed or unmarked. And there. Okay. Uh, ingredients. So this patch. That's 16 out of salt. Uh, actually, it's, yeah, out of salt, so everyone is going for salt. That sounds like a joke, like, we're in our salty waters and we're out of salt. <laughs> okay. 
uh, menu ta -ta -ta -ta. should be good and oh right it, the reason we are only getting one coin from green tea is because of course it sells for one coin uh, yeah, we were getting a plus on that before, but that was when we were serving it. Our actually, no, that was because of, uh, no, someone here had a yeah, someone here had a bonus with a skill for the drinks, a passive. Um, so let me double check with Cookstar. Let's see. platinum. What? Okay, we can't see what we got from that again. Hmm. They did say plus one slot for cooking or something, so why... Or does that only get unlocked later or something? Hmm. Perhaps. But it looks like there is space for someone next to be next to Banshu there. Yeah, it, it's only a little space next to... between him and the Wasabi. But, yeah. Anything else new here? No. Okay. Let's open her up. And yeah, we're basically playing third wheel with serving. Okay. Trying to keep an eye on everything. See if anyone's leaving a mess. Also, keep an eye on this. Raptor can do that as well. But I'd rather have him running back and forth while Nino well, cleans and serves. That way at least one of them is constantly moving back and forth. Okay. A good day, from the looks of it. Okay, 21 people. A decrease in profits, but still a big profit. And we back to yeah, five stars. And still able to pay the expenses. Yeah. Not that we are running short on that or anything, or that we are just getting along we are still making good profits you still storming oh, melting glacier and the vip is visiting today hello bacon been a bit since we've seen you since your little adventure hmm. dave is everything going well um i opened the passage in the glacial area but i can't explore the co uh, the area because it's too cold Oh, the current suit isn't warm, is not warm enough, I see. So the P C people gave me this cloth, but I don't know how to use it. The cloth is warm to the touch. This is the breeding apparatus I found in the sea people's cave. I could make a cold resistant suit if I had a mechanical part that can patch up the items. Oh, yellow. Mechanical parts. Don't you have one from John Watson's suit? You're right. Actually, I brought some complex me mechanical parts. This is, a, devi this is a, a, a device that automatically adjusts water pressure. I may be able to do something with this. But it's too damaged to be used without repair. Only if you could find one intact somewhere. Okay, that's a bummer. Oh, I have a good idea. What is it? I will tell you later in the evening. I need to organize my thoughts. You want us to go raid the... You want us to go raid them, don't you? I have a bad feeling about this. Yep, we're going to raid the raiders. All right. This little nuisance is up. Okay. Uh, needs to be cleaned. Okay, need some food. I need some affection. Okay. Middle, right, middle, left, middle. There we go. 
I think like, they handled that little game, small game there well. But I think games does... Uh, what's it called actually when you do that with the cup? Yeah, I think it's just it's simply ball. called the cup game or something. Or a yeah, cup for, game. I think games do it and do it badly. That they, so when it's actually impossible to tell where it is. Yeah. That they just <laughs> move at such rapid pace. I think the first time I actually encountered that was in a game called The Longest Journey. Which is actually a long going series. Oh dear. Okay, he's happy. But yeah, you had to... Uh, you had to cheat there in a way that wasn't uh, magical, since that was in a magical world. Great a egg. These can be harvested, and the way you would do that would be to use a, a magnetized screwdriver because the ball that they were using was made of metal, and well, a magnetized uh, screwdriver would attract the ball, but the reason you can't use magic in their game is because they had a medallion or something that would light up if, uh, if there was magic used nearby. Since you were using science instead, they cheated the game. <laughs> Nothing they could do about it. <laughs> okay. Let me take a look. <clears throat> I don't think we need to upgrade the box for a bit. So I want to save up for either the drone or the air tank. Just more health is going to be better. Hmm, yeah. Okay. But the box is so tempting. It would mean that we could bring more up, but most of our ingredients come from here now, I think. Okay, so many of these. Yeah, do, do we even have a breathing pair of shocks? Uh, we'll have to see in a second. Okay, and I get the feeling these are spawning more than just one each time. Or was it a chance of one each day? Or either way, they're... Or actually, no, it's also from row from things we killed, but we haven't killed many of the smaller things in our miles. Yeah. Uh, I'm, not, I'm not going to keep questioning it where all the fish comes from. Maybe they change things somewhat? We need to get one of these for a breeding pair. A little bunch of these. Yeah, we, ha we haven't touched these in a long while, so there must be something with the breeding that is upping the amount a lot. Freaking shrimp. Not that many. Puffer. These things are breeding like bloody mad. One extra here. Hmm. Yeah, I I can see why that's uh, one other person who was in stream chat that one time asked about the fish farm because this is just an insane amount that they are breeding here. Yeah. Holy. Cuttlefish. Oh, we have a brilliant pair of those uh, saw sharks. Yep. They can stick their nose in each other's business now. Let's see. Bound frogfish. Okay. Hell of a lot of these. There. There. Take two extra for to have four. Okay. I'm pretty sure the eco watchers wouldn't be too happy with us with breeding some of these since they are marking them as invasive species. Okay, keep all of that. 
And yeah, then we have okay, then Murray used to breathe. Mind as long as the invasive species is kept in captivity as such. Though there has been e e terrorist, I think I heard eco terrorist groups that have been stupid enough to release species that became invasive because they felt they should be free and release something that should not be released into the environment. Yeah. Like, I, I don't believe in animal rights and all that. But I just don't like the extremist groups. They actually just make things worse. Both for yeah. the animal and everyone else. Some people think they are helping when they are completely not helping. Yeah. Okay. Now then. Uh, we're going to have to wait for the evening before we can progress with the story. So... Yes, more hunting. Yeah. More shark this hunting. Time, this time we are more careful. Okay, here we go. We really need all that shark meat as we can get. Uh, oh, Greenland shark. Okay. It takes about 100, 150 years to becoming an adult. <laughs> okay. Wait. I didn't even know it was feasible, but did it say it would be one centimeter per year or. Not sure. Also, I probably should have brought the. Uh, <laughs> I, I should have swapped back to the normal. Uh, or to our usual gun. But oh well. Hello, treasure. They're not happy to see us. Wait, was that a penetrating shot? Does that mean I can actually get multiple things with one bullet? Yeah, I, I think we might be able to get multiple things with one round. Miss. Gotcha. Okay, you can thrash about all you want. You're going up to the surface anyways. Okay. I'll take that. Let's see. We need a bunch of fragments. That was the first time we caught one of those. It is one of those stupid eels. No, not eels rays. Hmm. Let's see, um, 15, let's see, 124, 15 times 8, uh, 30, 60, 120, about the same damage. If it was an upgraded one, then I'd pr perhaps swap. Uh, hello. Oh, oh, it's the whale. It's the family of the humpback whale I met earlier. So let's take a pic. Yeah, let's take a picture before they move on. This time, let's try and get it. Flashing mm. water. Yeah, good. Yeah. There oh, we go. That okay? That's a translation error. That's, a, that's blowing bubbles, not splashing water. Yeah. Oh uh, well. Oh, shark. Shark. Okay, white. Okay, yeah, I can see where the name white tip and black tip comes from because this one has white tips on its uh, dorsal and uh, tail fin. Yeah. Just, just watch out for the one uh, uh, the shark that uh, swims around with a trident. Should I even ask? Rogura? Uh, doesn't actually sound familiar to me. Uh, she's a VTuber and a shark of all life. <laughs> she's... She's the one that uh, became kind of famous for when she tested her mic for the first time on her first year just with the world. 
Oh, they might not pick out that up. So you're saying... Uh, oh, wait, my leg is moving, actually. Hmm? Uh, I feel like I cannot make that sound with my mic. Okay. Uh, but... Uh, G-U-R-A, do you mean that one? The you one with this... Are, yeah. Okay, then, then I just misheard you. I have heard of her, yeah? Uh, the yeah, one with the uh, shark uh, onesie or something? Yeah, uh, uh, so shark the rest, I guess? You know? A few more shark YouTubers are coming out. I think there's a the reason they... Someone came out as a Megalodon. Yeah, but... <laughs> Combo breaker. There we go. Send that one up. Okay then. Good. We typed it. I hope these all, right, all these uh, days now we'll be able to get as much shark meat as possible without any more disasters. Yeah. Golf club. <laughs> okay. Oh, yoink. Black tiger shrimp. Some mayo. Why does it say? Oh, okay, it probably says new because we ran out or something. Maybe. Or is that the first Are time we, we sure? actually found it on the, on the water? It, it said that the tiger meat was uh, new, but that was because we failed to harvest last time, I'm presuming. So we, we failed yeah, the previous Yeah, likely. Time. Due to... Oh. Yeah, that, that was just... just like, so we, were, we were one click away from victory there. It's basically like someone threw a banana peel just before the finish line. Every trip yeah. backwards. Okay. Give me some of that. I'll go grab that oxygen there. It's a reference to one, one of the many uh, Yoff sequels. I wouldn't know. I've never seen any of the Jaws sequels. Uh, Barracuda, what? no interest in that. I'll leave you well, alone this time. Much. Some of them are good, but the third, more and more, further up, the less you go, the worse they got. Actually, the, the, the uh, shock animatory got worse. Like they, eat, they made them cheaper and cheaper. There we go. Come here, you. Hey. Okay. Ow. I've got a bit of uh, angle now, which makes it awkward to hit. There. Actually, I have these. Come here, you. There we go. Harvest you. Uh, let's see. I mistook the sound effect for shooting sounds. <laughs> Let's check if there's something in here. This should hopefully be some ammo. Hmm. Okay. Oops, shark. 
Hammerhead. Okay. Maybe get if you look, we get the breathing pattern. <laughs> Stupid little crabs. I, I think this is a different species than the one we fought earlier. It looks smaller. Okay, don't stay too close. Come here. This is not enough to kill it. Good. Some marlin there. Okay, hopefully that'll take it out. Nope. Distance. Good. One more. Yes, one more. Okay. Let's grab this. Okay. Oh, seems like we got some collateral damage from the little guys bleeding. Okay. I'm, I'm not going to mess with this that one. Oop. But I think I am going to play with the crabs. There's probably going to be at least one crab party eventually. Up, out. Oh, wait, down. I think it's going to be a crab rave if they do that. Well, let's get rid of you. Oh dear, oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear. A lucky little thing. Okay, they're lucky. <laughs> they're okay. I'll just leave them be. They're getting protected by the other rocks there, since the crabs are on the foreground and the rocks are on the background more. Okay, I could probably get them by luring them away, but. It's, it's going to be a shark party, not a crab party. No. Could have been worse. Yeah. The crabs could have been armed with knives. <laughs> Lead ore. Not really what we need. But I'll take it all the same. Uh, let's see, we're on 100 meters deep, so we might find an escape point. Otherwise, we can just head straight up for the exit. The surface. Ooh. Anyway, didn't we get to the other side of this earlier? Uh. Yep, okay. Just head out here. And this place should be safe, so I can just speed up. Quite literally speeding up and going up. Okay. Uh, I started thinking. Oh. I think I lost count of how many VTubers I watch for. I usually watch the ones I find funny. I think that's a few, actually. Okay. Even slowed down, we're outspeeding <laughs> this one. But mostly it's through the dash. Yeah, that, that dash is really useful, so I'm, I'm pretty sure we're keeping that... I'm, I'm keeping that thing equipped at all time. Okay. The, that one turned around! Yeah, it, we, that was because we drew it far enough away from where its area was. Okay. There. Okay, good amount. Ornate Raz Row, Tiger Shark Row. Okay. And White Tip Reef Shark Row. Ooh. Oh. Udo, a humpback whale. What is it again to get amazing creature? Swim is for its love for family. Oh, oh family. 
Uh, yep. Yeah. 500, okay. Yeah, there, there are still photo spots underwater as well. More crops have grown. And this little thing wants some attention as well. Oh. No, no. It, okay, it grew up some. Yeah, but why... Why are you... Is it... Is it sick or something? Okay, it was sick. Okay. Give you some food. Looks like a lipstick. Play a bit. Okay. What's what is it with the warning here? <laughs> Hello, Marco. They grew up so fast. <laughs> Actually, what does it say about its age now? Okay, one year's oh, old. In just a few days. Hmm. Oh. It's still something marked with it, but I don't know what, nor do Probably I care too much either. Game. Okay. Right. Hmm. Should we do a night time as well? Uh... I think not. Also, I think I misunderstood this thing last time. It lures fish that are nearby. So this would be good to combine with either a net bomb or a net gun. Since, well, there'll be a lot of fish in a small area. Ah, uh, uh, makes sense. Makes sense. Okay, let's swap this one back to this. Hmm. Okay. Yeah. Oh, okay. <clears throat> I do... Oh, hello, what's going on here? Nutrient needs to be over 70 to restart farming. Do you have anything to say oh. about that? Yeah? <laughs> uh, do we have any... Let's buy a few of these. Can we use that here or something? Or just... Okay, I'm guessing the nutrient just refills on its own over time. Uh, let's see. I guess nutrient is basically the farm's health. Yeah. Uh, so if you see. don't take care of the weeds, it will die. Let's get some wheat seeds. Actually, let's get seeds of everything. And moving the storage box. Okay. And in case of emergency, we can just yeah. outright buy ingredients. Okay. For now, let's put that in there. Pull these out for next time. Okay. So we won't be constantly growing rice. The land does need to rest every now and then. Oh, yeah. Okay. Now, we can go down for another dive. Try and get some more sharks. And, yeah. The VIP is today. Okay. Okay. And yeah, it should be storming for the next few days as well, so we can paddock. Okay. So it should be... Yeah, we should be able to go find Klaus's hideout in any of the following days. But I'd really want to have a level 3 weapon for that first. Okay. Yeah. Scooter. Rum, rum. Any more? Oh. Yoink. And yoink. Let's see. We have a dish with the parrot fish now. Oh. Hello, Thrasher. But I'd prefer to get a great you missed shots. Both our sides. Yep, 
Ow. Okay, this thing is pretty nasty. But it's going to make for a decent dish. Right here, you. And you. Let's see, that's a sunken boat over there. Okay. Are uh, you still doing well, Marco? I'll take that. I won't use it yet, since there should be... There should be a good amount of oxygen that we can just find around. Okay. Yeah, we're just hunting for sharks, since there's going to be a shark party in a few days with this. We won't get there in this stream, but it's best, it's good to have food. Stock for them. Yeah, the sharks are more uh, common uh, than uh, swordfish and such. How are they more aggressive? Yeah, it's, it's also because it's storming, I think, that's there is more common now. Yep. Well, you went over easy, a lot easier than the thrasher. Uh, mm, yeah, I'll carve you. Freaking cuddlefish. Yes, want some cuddles. Okay, any oxygen around here? Can grab this. Need two more skulls. For the skull from? No, yeah, for the eco watchers. Let's see. Yep. A tiger. Ah, uh, the eco watchers are cool worship. Oh, hammerhead. Should have known. Okay, I'll use the oxygen tank then. Is there any ammo here? Need to grab. That would make things easier. Uh, I doubt that'll work on this shark, but I'll take it all the same. We need pink ones. Uh, let's see. It's annoyed. Ah, there's some ammo. Take you. And then I'll take you on. Yeah, that actually seems to tire it out a bit, those... that triple swing. Yeah, was it kind of weird to see? Okay, it's another meal ticket. Okay. Let's take this. What if we get some hammerhead row? Uh, yeah, having some breeding pairs of sharks would also be very useful. Oh yeah. It's... Every little bit helps. Barracuda. I'll just take you out to have you out of the way, because there's a big boy next to you. Okay. You seem as bait. I'll swap to this one for this fight, since we only have one shot in the gun. Oh, there's an upgraded one, I think. That's yeah, a level two. Charge. Ooh, damage. There we go. Okay. Yeah, those trigons are good. As long as you're careful when using them. Yeah. Okay. It works with the shark, or with these sharks, since they're easy enough to dodge. But Klaus is way too big and it's way too hard to risk getting that close. So. I think we'll definitely need to either upgrade the underwater rifle to level three, or use an up or upgrade the sniper. Let's see. This is lead. 
Hedgehog yeah, Seahorse. Okay. Ah. Okay, that was dumb of me. Yoink. Now, let's see if there's any sharks around here. And then we'll just play it safe and head up with the bounty instead of losing it all through a stupid Mako shark, or I believe it was a Mako shark. A nuisance shark, that was it certainly was. Yeah, oh yeah, we did. We did, we did identify, did we? Let's see. And the one. And the two. Okay, no sharks around here. Not going to swim fast. Actually, we can swim a bit fast since we have an oxygen tank. I think it's free as a thing. Hmm? I think the Greenland shop might be in the glacier soon. Probably. I'm guessing that's, that's where most of the new uh, fish are going to be that we're getting loading screens about. Level one triple. Oh, hello there. Ow. Yes, you're a new one. You are an aggressive one as well. Just like the one you beat you up earlier. Okay. Now let's see if we can get ourselves some revenge then. It's return faster than you do. <laughs> bring around the yeah, bring around the shark. There we go. Yep, yeah, Mako shark. The freaking. Okay, you're getting served as an extra. As, might as well grab all of these then. It's not like they can, can escape from us. And yeah, I, I do think... I think rain tends to agitate fish. <clears throat> so that could explain why there's a bunch of sharks around now. Okay. Yeah. I think okay. that's the case. Uh, I'll take you along. The rest of you... Actually, I'll keep you as well. All of the rank ones are going sent... are getting sent to the fish tank. Yeah, tiger shark meats. I think I saw something about a tiger shark tooth in the previous bit as well. Yeah, okay. and we got a row of the, one of the new sharks, I think. So what is the idea you mentioned earlier? Oh, oh that. Oh, what if you infiltrate the sea blue base and retrieve the mechanical parts? Mm. Me? Go to their base? Oh. Sea blue folk were scouting the area using underwater drones at night. Oh. Follow those drones and you will find our base. Mm. It sounds very dangerous. Oh. Don't worry. I will prepare an infiltration suit with camouflage patterns. Oh. It will hide you from plain sight at night. Oh. No guarantees, though. No. Um... Anyways, it's not dark enough yet, so I will see you later when I close the bar. Okay, so at least we can do the bar and... Okay, helicopter or something overhead? I think I missed that. that close... Oh, I think it's gonna be something similar like what we saw with the scientist. Let's see. Clean up. And lights out. Okay. Now then, there shouldn't be anything else for us, so let's go serve the customers. Okay. Um, 
With, with the random sp harpoon spear tips that we can find, I think the electric one is the best since it slows them, it slows other fish down. So it makes them easier to evade as well. I wonder if that would work on Klaus. Hello everyone, this is Yui from NDC Station. Ladies and gentlemen, as you know, today is the day of the showdown in Challenge the Chef. Pancho, are you ready? Of course. And Wang Pong? The same. I can't wait. Excellent. Let's begin Challenge the Chef now. Okay, how is this? <laughs> Have I noted that uh, Yui sounds a bit like Isabel from uh, Animal Crossing? You haven't. Well, I have now. Uh, Boncho will compete with the famous chef in, the, in a new TV show. Let's bring him the ingredients he asked for. Oh, oh hello. Uh... Okay, I didn't expect this. Crap onion. Okay. okay. Onions and quarters. Crap the stargazer. Okay. Uh, I have to say that I'm not much of a... F I'm a... Hmm. I'm a bit mixed on some of those coat go the fish with starts. Uh, yeah, very focus on this. Uh, there's a lot of competitive cooking shows that uh, I don't like because they think that it's more about the drama than the actual cooking and skill and such. Like, say what you want about Gordon Ramsay and such with his uh, manners, but he at least does he he at least does it for the uh, for the arts of the cooking, not just uh, to be a drama queen or anything. Actually, he hates drama queens in the shows that he does. Yeah, he wants to improve people's cooking and yeah. call out people or. Like, Bulls. you know, like, what it, yeah, like Hell's Kitchen is a good example. Yeah. He may be an asshole in that, but he's doing that to, yeah, uh, help people with it. Yeah, sometimes he runs into people that clearly do not want to help and clearly want to. That it clearly should not be running a restaurant. Oh, oh, I see. Uh, okay, I thought we had to hold it in. Uh, yeah, that's just moving it more. Okay, uh, yeah, this is <laughs> done bad. Okay, yeah, a bit of an ex a bit more explanation about some of these would have been nice. Uh, oh, we need to do this multiple times. Okay. Quickly. Oh, come on. Oh, no. Okay, the three times. Yep. Still done well. Yep, the <laughs> okay, one looks like absolute shit. But Vincent knows better than to judge Buncher's work on his look. Momo's just waiting for the scraps. <laughs> oh, oh, j just barely beaten out. Okay. Yeah, that the stir frying probably was the part that he yeah, caught up. Oh no, I lost. But I'm the best chef in Hong Kong. Of course, your dish was excellent, Wang Pang. Wang Pong. You used the finest ingredients for flawless taste. 
but it wasn't good enough to impress me. Hmm. But Bancho's dish? Hold on. It gave me a whole new experience with a fish called Stargazer. To be honest, it was my first time tasting the fish. Hmm. Bancho gave me a perfect blend of the interesting and fresh taste of the Stargazer and a, the classic taste of the sweet and sour sauce. Hmm. If we're talking only about the taste, yours was better, Wampon. But I highly admire Bancho's attempt to, uh, to present a foreign taste in a familiar way. My final, final word is Bancho. Congratulations. Oh, oh Vincent, cl Vincent clearly explained the reason for his decision. Bancho wins the match. Okay. Bancho, what are your thoughts? Ah, uh, my thoughts? Uh, I wanted to present the... <laughs> Thank you, Bancho. The champion saves words for more action and we love it. Today's winner of Challenge the Chef is Pancho, the vending champion. What a competition, what a judgment. <laughs> See you next time, this was reporter Yui. Okay. Uh, someone's a bit miffed, but hopefully he'll get a lesson from this. And not be too uh, sour on this. Amazing Pancho, you bested Wong, Pan, uh, Wong Pong in his area of expertise. <laughs> Who cares about nationality when it comes to food? Flavor is fair game. Why do I, I have this feeling? Yeah. Why do I have this feeling that this show will return again? But I have full confidence in your victory. Speaking of the contest, I got some new inspiration uh, inspirations for Chinese cuisine while pre uh, preparing for the competition. I'll write them down. Help me uh, try something new when you have time. Oh, new recipes, and we get a thousand from that, and fifty likes. Okay. A lot of blue tang and everything else. Okay. Uh, up in the top, we have how many followers we have. Uh, yeah, still going to be a while until we reach the next cap. No, I get the feeling it might be more of an end game thing. Uh, let's see. Enough to upgrade, but not to upgrade and then serve. So let's do one serving of these, or rather six of those from one. Uh, let's see. Uh, let's put one set of servings of that. Uh, let's do two of these. Let's see, that is 22 already. Okay, and then... No, not that many. 26, and then lastly, one extra filler. With... Yeah, let, let's, let's use up the sea grapes that we have. Hmm. Yeah, ac actually, I re re just remember, we forgot to plant the other seaweeds. Oh well. Yeah, this uh, we this looks good enough to me. We Research. Let's see. Fried rice with Galapagos red crab. Okay. Blobfish spring roll. Galapagos. Yeah, Galapagos, yeah. Galapagos. Tomato egg soup. Uh, let's see. Fried tomato and snail fish. Okay, let's go for that one. Save one artisan's flame in case we manage to beat Klaus. Hmm. There we are, starting to come up on the end of the stream again. Let's see, staff. Okay. Let's see. We're good on most things. Black pepper? Where did we get black pepper from? I think that's new. But yeah, yeah. It, it is new. This is the thing. Mm. I guess one of them found black pepper, maybe. Uh, yeah, I, I, I think I saw with some of them they had an extra thing. Let's see. You two go for the pep yeah, pepper. Then sesame seeds, you two. What about okay. sesame seeds? No. All right. Uh, one last clearing. There are still a few fish here that we haven't found in the shallows. And yeah, Klaus, that's definitely Klaus. 
a rather the great ride as that would probably be labeled here okay also let's get these unmarked it's really just a three, three minute long track of that okay shooting star okay up I'll probably give the whole OST a listen some other time, but they're oh. Okay, this is just even an ugly mug on there. Shark like games. And Finned Ancestors. Okay. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm going to avoid looking up the OST at the moment because there might be uh, spoilers in there somewhere, since a lot of tracks get named after the scenes that they happen in and such. So, one last look. 10, 22, 27, 30-ish. Okay, here we go. Hey. Oh, wait. Wrong phrase. Okay. Okay. On the one hand, we've kind of made ourselves uh, unneeded with this, but on the other, it, it is a good thing to see something develop past uh, your own need, needing you. Yeah. Let's land a hand. He already got that. Oop. I'll take this. Yep. Just because we're not entirely needed doesn't mean we can't land a hand. It just gives the others more time to serve the others. Now, so the reason that I'm cutting those shorts uh, whenever I can is to the uh, little animation at the end. Uh, oh, wait. oh, we we sold the hell out. Okay, that's a first. Okay, we're going to need more than 30 dishes each day now. Yep. <laughs> exactly 30 people, apparently. Okay, we did lose a bit because we ran out. But yeah, uh, I guess 35 dishes a day should be good now. Okay. Phew, this should be enough. Dave, you're here. I'm the one who drives this boat, of course I'm here. You you were already on it when we left. <laughs> it's so dark, are you sure there's something there? Just put on this infiltration gear, it will help you stay unnoticed. Okay, it doesn't look that much different. It it's it's darker and not as much ye the yellow is gone it why is his nose covered <laughs> oh i feel like i'm being a secret agent oh. dressed for success you look ready to enter dark moses island <laughs> in that <laughs> dark moses shadow moses island metal gear oh well into the water now you will see roman drones underwater Follow them unnoticed. I bet they will lead you to Sea Blue's base. And I think we can guess where that is. Alright, leave your weapons here. What? You want me to infiltrate their base unarmed? Sea Blue runs a tight security system with sentry drones and sensors. If one of the drones detects a weapon, they will alert the base immediately. Uh, also, it would probably not be the best idea to just go killing a bunch of them. This is a covert operation anyway. Going in secretly and coming back with a mechanical part? Simple, right? In theory. <laughs> what am I doing here skipping sleep? <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah, we are close to the end, but I think we can do this still, and then we'll call it for today, and then I'll be back on the weekend, hopefully. That must be one of C yeah. Blue's sentry drones. Mm. You should follow it from a distance. Is it? A 
we don't have a harpoon, so... Okay, luckily enough, this gear also makes us harder to find for the other things, like big old fish up there. Oops. Ah. No, it's not. Yep, yep, yep. Damn it. Yeah, it, it, is, it is harder to see things now as well. Okay, there it is. It's got to stay at enough distance. And yeah, I called it. Okay. Oh, I hit an entrance. I should hurry before the door closes. Yeah. And that wasn't that hidden. Oh, hello. The, <laughs> the sensor at the front is rather obvious. Are we going to get more Metal Gear references here? Yep. Well, there's one right away, because there's part for the boxes. Isn't this too big to be a hidden base? Where are the facilities at? What are these facilities for? Machines processing dolphin meat? I'm confused. Aren't sea blue environmentalists? What in the world are these for? I'm, yeah, I, I called it on that as well. They're working with the poachers. It, it's a front. I must find some mechanical parts for now. Okay. Get special suit components from the top floor. Be careful not to get caught by soldiers or cameras. Okay. Quickly. <laughs> uh, yeah, sea blue is a front. Uh, sea blue is a front for the pirates and poachers. I'm guessing that John Watson might be the only one who's actually not in on the joke, so to say. Or maybe he's compensating by being hyper-aggressive. That that's a bunch of dead fish over there. Not even we can get that much of a haul in a single day. Nope. <laughs> This guy really has his mask on too tight for that. <laughs> okay. Dave just freezing his ass off in there. Okay. Uh, I didn't see if there was anyone up here. Ration? Military rations in a tin case. It's hard to imagine what these would taste like. Oh, it, it, an MRE? A, a ration eater achievement. Yep. <laughs> and that was another... Yeah, that was another <laughs> Metal Gear reference more to the Snake Eater. Uh, yeah, um, MREs. Yeah. Meals rejected by the enemy. <laughs> It looks like an office. Uh, it looks like it uh, contains some mechanical parts here. Man, I miss my warm, clean bed at home. Okay. Keep the sea blue poster. I can't believe what they may have been doing behind everyone's back. Uh, that's the parts. It's, it has a drawing of the sea blue research. Wait, isn't this me in the picture? And there's also Boncho and Dr. Bacon. Core component of the sea blue tech suit. It looked quite complicated. Good, here it is. Let me take it. Welp, that's a problem. Quick, Dave. Dive! Hold it! 
You call it. Yep. <laughs> what other way? I very much doubt they would have kept us alive for a prison sec escape section. But yeah, Deep Blue is just a cover for poachers and pirates. We should have brought the. We should have used the camera. Oh, Dave, you came back in one piece. Well, I sense a lack of trust in your voice regarding my survival skills. <laughs> Come on, take a look at this thing. Sea Blue's mechanical part, in pristine condition. Why didn't you warn me of the armed pirates? Honestly, I didn't know their presence. Anyway, I found many pieces of equipment used to process and freeze fish at Sea Blue's base. And I believe they caught some dolphins as well. Isn't Sea Blue a, a group of environmentalists? Does that make them hypocrites? Yeah. It definitely does. Knowing they might have been exposed, uh, knowing they have been exposed might make them more dangerous. You better be careful. Anyway, get some rest. It's getting late. I will talk to Doctor Bacon tomorrow. Okay, then they can get to work on that suit, and then the next day we'll probably get this. It then the next day we'll probably get it. But yeah. Hmm. Now, I am a bit curious on if uh, Watson is in on it or not. Like, the way how violent he is makes me think that he is in on it. Or they're just yeah. he's just a useful tool. I went home late and couldn't sleep well last night. Yeah, you did a good job last night. Let's go report to Dr. Bacon. Okay. Hey, Dave. I heard that you required an intact mechan me mechanical part. Mm -hmm. Yes, with difficulties. Mm -hmm. Here, take it. Yes, this is it. Good job, Dave. Okay, now I have everything I need. I will go to the lab and craft a cold-resistant suit. But... I'm worried about the fact that the glacial area is unstable. I suggest you get a good weapon as well as a good suit. Yeah, there was a new material developed at the lab. The dive knife can be upgraded. As usual, you can upgrade it through Eye Diver. Upgrading the dive knife not only increases its attack power, but you can also mine minerals that previously could only be mined with a pickaxe. Okay, that's going to be useful. Oh, then I won't have to go looking for the pickaxe. <laughs> Give me a day to craft the suit. I will see you tomorrow. Call it. Okay. A cold resistant suit. I wonder what that will look like. Like like Dr. Bacon said, a suit won't be enough to protect yourself. Don't you think you should bring a weapon? Mm. I think so too. Mm -hmm. I will go ask Doc. This is them heavily <laughs> hinting this is us them heavily nudging us to get an upgraded weapon. Uh, you can now enhance dive knife in eye diver. Enhancing the knife increases base damage and allows you to gather higher grade materials. Okay. Yep. The fishmon this week, as detected by the radar, is... What is this? A jellyfish with some kind of wizard hat? <laughs> that can't be a real jellyfish. Goodness, do you doubt the accuracy of our fish radar? Uh. Yes. It was a very difficult task detecting this jellyfish with our radar. The reason was... <laughs> this jellyfish teleports around at incredible speeds. Mm. It'll disappear as soon as you go near. You probably won't be able to catch it unless you have something like a sniper rifle. About 100 meters on the water, near the yellow shipwreck. Oh. That's what my information says. <laughs> <laughs> now then, keep up the good work this week. Mm. Jellyfish that teleports? That looks kind of interesting, I suppose. Okay, we you should sure you use... That? <laughs> Probably not, but... Uh, yeah, I think we'll need the tranquilizer sniper for that. So, one last thing before we go, just to keep this little thing busy. I'm not on cue, now my headphone tells me I, it needs to re beam recharge. Okay, let's feed you a snack as well, see if that does anything. Okay, that just makes you... wait. Okay, snacks raise affection. Okay. I have to say that uh, I personally find high-pitched tunes like this to be often more annoying with these kind of things than it. Yeah, I can tolerate them in small amounts. Okay. Okay, that brings up training. Hmm. 
let's leave it at that. Okay. And with that, yeah, we'll have a save. Uh, all the way down here in the last one. Then we save and return to title. Okay, this time though, we are going to raid someone. So whilst I close off the game, there. And now we change the screen share to Twitch. And let's have a look there, go live. Let's see, good amount of people online. We have Nico doing art. We have Weave the Leaf with Fay Farm. Can't say I've heard of that, so let's take a peek. Uh, let's see. Okay, it looks it looks pretty modern. Uh, hmm. Then we have Cider Delish with Radasia stories. Okay, this looks a bit older. Uh, hmm. Yeah, da, da, da. Side of the list wonders if the main character knows he has the same name as a dog breed. <laughs> okay. Then we have I'm Nice who is streaming Pikmin 4. I am prob I'm probably going to pick up that game myself. Like, I've never played any of the Pikmin games, and I honestly had more interest in watching other people play it. Uh, but uh, now that it is... Now that there is a new one out, I am... Uh, I am getting curious about playing it myself. So also, I, I believe this for this fourth one is also pretty easy. <laughs> and oh, hello there! Frogcast is streaming Dave the Diver. So, uh, oh, they, they've managed to kill a tiger shark. Let's see. I thought like we should raid them. It has been a while yeah. since we raided them. Yeah. Looks like they're pretty early in, since they still need to bring Ellie their shells and such. So, yeah, <laughs> they got their own Tamagotchi already. Okay. Go to our place, then slash raid and paste. But before we start that, of course, thank you everyone who has been watching now or later. So, yeah, thank you, Marco. And thank you, as always, Drakir. You're welcome, as always, my friend. And thank you all for watching and joining. Yeah. And, yeah, I'll be unable to stream until the weekend, about, probably. And yeah, then I'll probably hear about month somewhere around Monday if one of those jobs that I got a uh, if one of yeah uh, I got I don't think I said this on stream but I got uh, call I got some phone calls about uh, possible jobs uh, earlier today and only now do I notice that that chair over there is rather mangled oh, oh well <laughs> so it was um, something weird about that chair yeah uh, okay. Hmm. But yeah, we'll, we'll see if uh, I might have a new job in the next week somewhere. Uh, we'll, of course, need to be interviews and all that stuff. But oh well. Uh, for now, let's get that raid started. And yeah, next weekend we will find... Uh, uh, we will uh, start with the game that will be, will be replacing Dave the Diver as one of our side quests. Whilst Dave becomes the main quest until we're done with it. Oh, yeah. So, yeah. For now, though, thank you all again for watching. And until next time, have a nice day. And until then. Be safe, everyone. And watch out for zombie seagulls and zombie sharks. And Klaus. Ugh.